Hello, this is me, Anna, Anna Kornakova in sweatshop in Moscow, Russia. Today I talk about something I love, garlic. It's amazing. Uh, you can put it in all your food, but it's not just for the food. Uh, you can use it as a body spray. I throw out expensive perfumes someone give me and I fill it with garlic and I just... I spray everywhere. It's amazing. You attract people wherever you go. Uh, or if you are poor, you can use the garlic uh, as essential oil. Just uh, uh, rub it on your wrist. Uh, you go on the job interview, throw garlic in your mouth. They love it. I'm telling you, you get the job. Or you go on the date, put it in your salad, guaranteed mate. Uh, but if he don't, like the garlic, throw the garlic at him because he is imposter and a liar if he tell you uh, he is Eastern European and he don't like garlic. He doesn't exist, so he is vampire. But uh, somebody tell me, you know, uh, not everybody in this country love garlic. And I say, what you mean? These, they are vampire? And she say, no, everybody uh, is different in this country. Uh, garlic is an acquired taste. You may not like it at first, or uh, you only like it in small doses. And I say, oh, like Maria from our book club. Strong personality, a little crazy. And she says, maybe. And I say, yes, some people are like garlic. Acquired taste. You can only handle them in small doses. You need patience, you need the grace. But then I remember sometimes I am like garlic. You are like garlic. Uh, we are not always easy to hang around. We have our issues too. So when you are tempted to lose patience on somebody, just remember you are like garlic. We criticize uh, people all the time. Oh, we criticize her because she have low cut blouse when honey, two weeks ago, you were wearing mini skirt. Uh, we criticize that woman because she sing false when honey, you failed your drug test two weeks ago, but I'm not gonna talk about it. We need to have grace because sometimes we forget that we too are like garlic. Sometimes we are acquired taste who need grace. Thank you.